Hi guys, it's Wendy here from Wendy Wise Beauty. Thanks for stopping by and for visiting me again on my channel. Finally, I am getting to my lip swatch video. Guys, I bought so many lipsticks when the mask mandate was lifted here and we could wear lipstick again without hiding it under a mask. So I just wanted to do a lip swatch video for you guys showcasing some of my latest lipsticks and some of those that I am especially looking forward to wearing this summer. Stay tuned and here we go. Some of these lipsticks I have already tested out or worn. The first one on my list, it's the lightest one. These are the Kiss Kiss B Glow lipsticks, which were, I believe these were introduced in the spring from Guerlain. I got this in 809 Lavanda Glow. This is what this one looks like. These lipsticks are more transparent and more like a gloss. This is the way the Lavanda Glow looks. Honestly, honestly, honest to goodness truth. This lipstick was close to 40 euros and this is what I got. I honestly can't see myself picking this up again. It is beautiful packaging, classic Guillain, but I cannot justify this price for a lip balm. No. I am not someone who is wearing chapsticks unless my lips are in really bad condition. I am a lipstick girl and I don't get any quality price returns in those lipsticks. I mean, for me, this is all packaging. I will use it, but no more repurchase on this one. Next one on my list, this is the Dio Addict. These are the new lipsticks which came out in spring. It is called the Shine Lipstick Intense Color. I got this one in the color 972 Silhouette. I have worn this lipstick I think once or twice and they do bleed a lot, especially since I have mature skin. So I will go ahead and apply a lip liner with this one. I also got some lip liners from Guillain and I will pair this with number 24, Rouge Dahlia. This is the way these looks. They are retractable pencils. This is the Gila, it's called the Lip Liner Lasting Color High Precision Lip Liner. This is the Dior Addict Shine Lipstick in the color Silhouette. These lipsticks, they look very shiny, they look beautiful on the lips, but you have to be a bit careful because they do transfer quite easily. I love the shine, I love the color, but um, the fact that they smear so easily does not make them for me such a big winner. I have a lot better lipsticks from Dio. Also the lasting power of these lipsticks, they are not all that they could be. But they do look gorgeous, right? When you apply them. So this is the color Silhouette from Dio.
The next lipstick that I have, it is from Gila. This is the Rouge G Luxurious Velvet line of lipsticks where you have to buy the casing. Also for the lipstick, I have this in number 1870, which is Rouge Imperial. The lipstick comes like this. You have to buy the... Um, the casing which has a lovely mirror and then the lipstick comes like this it has a protective cap on the end and then this lipstick is assembled these are gorgeous lipsticks this is the Guillain Rouge G Velvet lipstick in number 1870, Woosh Imperial. These lipsticks are so beautiful on the lips. They do not smear. Actually, I did not add any lip liner. And they just feel so creamy, but at the same time, it's more of a powdery matte finish. This is number 1870 Woosh Imperial. Gorgeous, gorgeous lipstick from Gila. Next, I have two lipsticks from the Lancon L'Obsolu Woosh Cream Lipsticks. I have 196 French Toast and 193 Passionema. I was in a bit of an orange lipstick mood when I got these two. I have worn these once or twice on this channel here. I kept the boxes because I knew I have been wanting to do this lipstick swatch video for such a long time. I have used French toast before 196 but I don't believe I have used a passionément. So I will first go ahead and I will swatch 193, which is passionément. Guys, this is the Guillain Le Absolu cream lipstick in number 193 Passionément. This is such a beautiful orange color lipstick which is perfect for summer. These lipsticks are very creamy but at the same time they have very strong lasting power and they do remain put on the lips they do not bleed like the dior addict lipstick that i did uh, the second lipstick that i applied these are awesome lipsticks so this one is again 193 and i will now go ahead and swatch french touch this is 196 french touch This is 196 French Touch. The first time I wore this on here, quite a few of you asked me which lipstick I was wearing. Now you have it. Beautiful, creamy. This one is not as orange as Passionément, but it does have a good dose of orange in the lipstick. <laughs> and the last lipstick for this lip swatch video it is number 422 from Pat McGrath it is sedition this is once again the Lux Trans lipstick from Pat McGrath in the color sedition beautiful gorgeous red color well guys with this 
this is the end of this lip swatch video i hope you liked it take care and hope to see you again soon on my channel ciao bye bye